you will know for today's video we are going to be taking all of you know my exotic cats swimming in the pool we're going to be teaching them how to swim we're basically going to be spinning the wheel let's go guys one let's go get that bubble she's going to you hannah here come this way what is up everyone and welcome back to the channel i hope all of you guys are having just an absolutely amazing day now for today's video well i am so excited for today's video it is going to be an absolute blast and i'm so excited that i get to share it with all of you guys so if you saw the title and thumbnail well you will know for today's video we are going to be taking all of you know my exotic cats swimming in the pool we're going to be teaching them how to swim in this gorgeous i basically call it a freshwater lagoon it's my swimming pool it's crystal clear blue cool water it's absolutely incredible and today we're going to be taking nebula my clouded leopard in the pool and we're going to be taking cheech and chong my rescued servals now before we actually hop into the pool well we have actually got to pick which animal we're going to take in first second and third and what better way to do that than with a spin the wheel i've actually got some pictures printed out of both cheech chong and nebula and well i've just got to slap them on a wheel we're going to spin the wheel whichever one it lands on we're going to take swimming first so if you guys want to see me take these exotic cats swimming in the pool for the first time well guys you are in the right place and well we're gonna hop right into that guys we've got the spin the wheel set up it looks absolutely amazing and here it is right here we basically are still using the pirate ship wheel that my grandpa pulled off of a ship and we have our three cats right here we've got cheech we've got chong and we have nebula the clouded leopard so these right here are the three cats that we are going to be taking in the pool but to make it fun i decided to do spin the wheel so we're basically going to be spinning the wheel and whatever animal it lands on well that is the animal we're going to be taking in the pool first then we're going to spin it again and that's going to be our second so without further ado guys we are going to hop right into this we are going to be spinning this wheel right here we're just going to take it we're going to spin it real good right there but i kind of need my sister's help here hannah hannah are you there are you there i think she's coming hello i need your help hello hi 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 can you can you hold this camera for me okay yes all right hannah's gonna hold the camera Hannah is holding the camera for me. How does we look? Is it really bright, guys? It's really bright. I'm sorry. If it's really bright on there, I'm sorry. It's just, it's bright out. So basically, like I was telling everyone, we have got our spin the wheel, Hannah. Which one do you want to land first? Which one do you want? Nebula. You want, ne yeah, I kind of want Nebula. Nebula is a lot of fun. Nebula is a clouded leopard, and the clouded leopards kind of will use the water sometimes. So basically, this is our makeshift spin the wheel. We don't have a real one. We need to buy one, guys. If you subscribe and watch the video and we make enough money on this, then we're going to buy one. But anyways, we have got to spin the wheel. So this right here is going to be our marker right here. So whichever, whichever animal lands here first is the one we're going to be spinning first. So we're just going to do a spin run right now. We're going to go one, two, three. All right, nothing. Let's go again. All right, I think, well, Cheech is the closest, so Cheech would be that right there. But this is just a couple of test runs, so we're going to get ready to do this for real for the first time. We are going to do our first spin right now in three, two, one. Let's go, guys. One, let's go. Well, it looks like it landed on Chong. We're going to be taking Mr. Chong, man, Mr. Chunky Boy in the pool first. So that's great. So we've got Chong going in first. Now we're going to have to spin it again to see which one is going to go second. And then whoever goes second is going to go second. And then the remaining one is going to be the last one. We're going to go one, two, three. Okay, Nebula is the winner for number two. So we're going to be taking Chong in first, then Nebula the Clouded Leopard, and then Mr. Cheech. Now, based on last video where we actually took the baby servos hunting for fish, Cheech did not like the water. He was a little bit interested. He didn't want to do it at all. He didn't like it too much, but Chong dove right in. So I'm thinking Chong's going to like the water. I'm not really sure. If Chong doesn't like it, we'll take him out. If Cheech doesn't like it, we'll take him out. But I am almost certain that Nebula is going to love it. But guys, there is only one way to find out. So you know what we're going to do? now we are not gonna go take them swimming first we're actually we've got some fig bars and we, we got to feed the lemurs first bro, fish, bro. oh my gosh my lemur children are right here so we've got some gluten-free fig bars here made with ancient grains so this is just a little treat the lemurs have already had their breakfast this is just like an early afternoon little snack you can see they love their food guys Oh my goodness, look what I have here. I have the best treats. Oh my gosh, you can see they're going crazy. Here, Rufus, you take that. Rue, 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 no, no, don't, don't steal, hey, don't steal it. Here, Rue, is that tasty, is that good? Oh my goodness, watching the lemurs eat their snacks is just so good. Rufus, 
Can I have a bite, sir? Well, Rufus and Rue got their snack, and so now, the moment you guys have been waiting for, we're gonna go inside, we're gonna grab Chong, and take him for his swimming lesson. One minute, 37 seconds later. I've got Chong, he's here, and well, Chong might be a fan of the water, I'm not sure. He'd love to catch the fish, but I'm not sure. These are African cats, they really don't go in the water, but if you introduce them from a young age in the water, they might like it. Again, Chong doesn't like it, we're not gonna force him. He's gonna be a little bit freaked out, but this is a great introduction. If I had Chong from the beginning, I would've liked to have introduced him from day one in the water, from when he was a young little guy, but just doing it right now. Oh, oh, Chong, ow, ow! Here you go, buddy. We're just gonna put you in. Now it's not that scary. Look at him. Chong is starting to swim. Now look at this, you're doing so well. Now I don't think he's gonna do a full on swim, but this is a great introduction to the water. The fact that I'm able to make a suggestion to him and tell him it's okay and get him acclimated in the water is a great sign. He's not freaking out, his ears are not back. He's just taking everything in. And this is incredible enrichment for this cat right here. New sights, sounds, and smells is exactly what we want for these animals. By having a hands-on relationship with these animals, we're able to give them incredible enrichment that we otherwise would not be able to. Like bringing them in the pool right here, introducing them to new environments. And I would say Chong is just a natural in the water. Oh, look at him, he's going for the bubbles. Get that bubble, look at him. Guys, he is absolutely loving it. And you can see that his claws are out. Ow, what the heck, man? Hey Chong, you wanna come on this raft right here? Now I just wanna bring him onto the raft he doesn't really like it because it's a little bit uneven, but let's see if I can just get him used to it right here. You wanna hang out on the raft? Now Chong may hang out on the raft, he might not, but the kind of uneasiness and unbalance of it, he might not like all that much just because it kind of just moves real funny. They like to have solid ground. Guys, I'm so happy that Chong is loving the water. I think he wants to, you wanna go back in? Here, why don't we go this way? Let's go right here. I guess we're not gonna use this. Let's send that that way. Being in the water, kicking and paddling is great for Chong because he actually has three pins in his leg because he broke his leg due to a calcium deficiency because his previous owner was not aware of the proper diet of these guys. So by giving him that exercise, by kicking back and forth, he's able to gain strength back in his leg in both the muscle and the bone. Chong, you're doing amazing, buddy. You're doing so well. I love you, man. You're doing so good. It's safe to say Chong absolutely loved the pool. It was a couple moments where he was unsure, but overall he enjoyed it. So now that we took Chong in the pool, well, we gotta grab Nebula the Leopard. Well, we've gotta grab Nebula the Leopard and take her in. We've got Nebula and we are getting ready to go in the pool. I think she's going to absolutely love it, guys. Comment down below, what do you think? Is Nebula gonna like the pool? Maybe she will, maybe she won't, but there's only one way to find out. Well, I think this pretty girl is ready to go in. So guys, let's get to it, let's go on in. Nebula, how are you doing, girl? Let's go on in the water. Let's go on in. Now we're just gonna slowly introduce her. Are you gonna hang out on my shoulders, pretty girl? Yeah, look, look at the water. You wanna go in? Is this familiar to you? For a cat like a clouded leopard that spends most of the time way up in the trees, they naturally aren't gonna be huge swimmers. But I believe in the wild every now and then, I think they'll jump in the streams to actually hunt fish in the wild. So I think by introducing her into the water now, I think she's gonna absolutely love it. And later on in her life, I wanna add a big giant water feature with a stream in her permanent enclosure. So I want her to be able to utilize that fully and be confident in the water. Where are you going, girl? What? What is it? Here, let's go in. Let's go in right here. What? Oh my goodness, I'm not sure if that water, that was kind of scary water right there. That water is kind of scary. Nebula is, Nebula is quite curious about the water. Oh. <laughs> All right, Nebula, let's go swimming, let's go. Nebula is my co-pilot here in the pool. I'm going under, she's on top. She's making sure everything's going well. She's going to you, Hannah. Here, come this way. Come this way, girl. Come here, come here. Ah, ha, ha. this is exactly what we wanted. A swim lesson going well. Look at this pretty girl right here. She's on my back, she's on my arm. And look at that incredible nimble balance the Clouded Leopard has. Their feet are developed for the trees, for climbing, and getting to see her balance on me is just incredible. Hey, let's go on in. Let's come right here. Let's go this way. Come on, girl. Let's swim this way. Come on. Let's go, let's go. Where are you going? You headed? Where are we going? Oh, you want to go to the edge? Let's go to the edge, let's go, let's go, let's go, yeah. You did it, girl. You did it. You did so well in the water. You are just such a pretty kid right here. 
Well, it is safe to say that Nebula is loving the pool. I think she loved it, guys. What do you think? She's having a good time. She's just hanging out on my head. And well, that is going to end today's episode. I don't think we're going to take Cheech in the pool because I just really don't think he's going to enjoy it all that much. So guys, that's going to end today's episode. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Make sure to go comment down below what you thought of today's crazy video. And guys, if you're not subscribed yet, you want to see us teach more animals how to swim. You want to see tigers, lions, turtles, and tortoises, and all kinds of crazy animals. So guys, all you got to do is go right now, hit the subscribe button, tap that little notification bell, and you all be notified whenever I post.